Never been to a football game. So I'm pretty bad. I don't know if I could say this word, but douchey. The Knights have seized 11 conference championships on the gridiron throughout their 134-year tenure. In their rich history, the Knights reigned superior to the University of Minnesota Golden Gophers, the University of Chicago Maroons. Their record was so stellar, in fact, that the prospect of joining the Big Ten League was not too distant. In their more recent history, however, the Carlton Knights' record has been on the decline. But starting this winter, the team has taken a turn in a new direction. They commit to a daily 6 a.m. workout in Laird Stadium. And here is the untold story of the Carlton Knights. Done in the morning, set yourself up for the rest of the day. If you don't get anything done in the morning, you're going to get anything done all day. I've never had a group that has been more um, dedicated or more up to a challenge than, than this team. This team, you know, it's like I've been around teams that have been good, and I've been around teams that have been good in the past. And you know, this is a team that's really willing to fight and claw, you know, through this conference to try to, you know, make a name for themselves and, and take a stake in, in that piece of that pie. You know, and it's like every day they've come in, it's like I've never had to say, okay, guys, let's get going. It's they come in, they get after it, and you know, it's, it's refreshing because. They're, they're going to they're gonna do great things if they're willing to keep putting in that effort and they keep the drive and keep the want to. So. Reassessing uh, what we're doing, um, how we're playing, uh, and, our, and our motivation behind that uh, is definitely the key that we're doing right now. Um, we're, we've been on a slide for a while. And it's, uh, it's going to be good to have a new lifting coach to, uh, that's pushing us a little bit more. Everyone's working harder with a new lifting coach. It's coming down to you know how hard you're willing to work, how much effort are you willing to put into it. And if the things like we can do with like our um, Friday finishers, it's like who is willing to fight through to the end because that's what it comes down to is you know we might be in a close game, but it's who's going to want it bad enough. And that's that's the point of trying to get up early in the morning. That's the point of trying to push you guys through so many, um, the team through so many different challenging things is to try to see who's willing to fight 